एवरी वन इट्स मी अमन रॉय टूडे वी विल स्टडी अबाउट दरिफाइज मीटर दिस इज द लाइन डायग्राम ऑफ ऑरिफाइज मीटर हेयर फ्लो इज फ्लोइंग फ्रॉम हेयर एंड दिस इज द लार्जर एरिया एंड ऑरिफाइज मीटर इज सेट एट द मिडल ऑफ द पाइप एंड एरिया इज रिड्यूज एंड अगेन दिस इज द लार्जर एरिया Here we have more pressure. After the passing from the orifice meter, we get less pressure, but the velocity increases. Here velocity is lesser, and here velocity is higher after passing from the orifice meter. But here higher pressure, and after passing from the orifice meter, we have low pressure. This is the larger diameter. this is the diameter of pipe and this is the diameter of orifice meter here you can see that this is the pressure pressure line how it decreases or increases and this is the distance travel by the flow this is the definition for you you can write it orifice meter consists of a flat circular plate which has a circular hole in concentric with the pipe this arrangement is called orifice meter the diameter of the orifice is generally 0.5 times of the diameter of pipe it may vary from 0.4 to 0.8 times of the pipe diameter now here you can see that this is the diameter of orifice meter this may vary from 0.5 to 0.8 times than the diameter of pipe lesser than the diameter of pipe this is the diameter of pipe and this is the diameter of orifice meter orifice meter generally used to measure the discharge and we can calculate the coefficient of discharge by using this formula q is equal to cd into a not a1 root under a1 square minus a not square into root 2gh here q is equal to discharge and cd is equal to coefficient of discharge and cc is equal to coefficient of contraction this area will be a not and this area will be a1 now here cc is equal to a1 upon a not a1 is the area of larger size or area of pipe and a not is the area of orifice meter now cd coefficient of discharge is equal to coefficient of velocity into coefficient of contraction and co coefficient of velocity will be actual velocity upon theoretical velocity you can say that cb is the ratio of actual velocity to the theoretical velocity and cc is the ratio of actual area to the theoretical area now the formula of discharge q is equal to cd into a not into a1 upon root under a1 square minus a not square into root 2gh we have not h so how to calculate the h the will be formula will be h is equal to sm minus 1 into hm hm is the head difference of water and sm is the density of mercury upon density of flowing fluid density of mercury is the 13.6 times of water and the density of generally if the uh, the density of flowing fluid is not given in the problem then we will take an as density of water it is 1000 so you can calculate the discharge or coefficient of discharge, discharge by using the formula friends if you like this video 
then like subscribe and comment